friends, welcome back to my channel. Besides, monitoring your blood sugar and cholesterol levels, you need to keep a track of your triglycerides. Triglycerides are a type of fat found in your blood. They are necessary as they supply your body with energy. Too many triglycerides are associated with an increased risk of heart disease. Elevated levels can even cause acute inflammation of the pancreas, in extreme cases. In today's video, we'll be discussing 10 simple ways to lower your triglycerides. Will losing weight help? Does sleep play an important role? Will eating fish help? We'll be talking about all of these and more of one. Control your weight. I know, it's easier said than done. But hard work pays off. Shedding a few pounds can actually reduce your triglyceride levels. When we eat more calories than we burn, the extra is converted into triglycerides by our body and stored in the fat cells. Triglyceride levels above the normal range of 150 mg per deciliter are referred to as high triglyceride levels in the blood. Studies suggest that even a moderate 5-10% reduction in weight significantly reduces these levels. Have you lost weight recently? What lifestyle changes did you make? Share your experiences with us in the comments below. 2. Follow a low-carb diet. It might be easier to stick to a low-carb diet if you know that your triglycerides have inched up. Extra carbs from your diet are converted into triglycerides and stored in the fat cells, which will then increase your triglycerides. A 2006 study showed that people who consumed more than 50% of their calories from carbs had higher levels of triglycerides than people who got only 25% of their calories from carbs. Following a low-carb diet helps reduce weight and triglycerides. 3. Eat fiber-rich foods. Foods like whole grains, fruits, veggies, Nuts, cereals, and legumes should be incorporated in your diet as they have loads of fiber. Fiber is not digested and lowers the absorption of extra fat and sugar in the small intestine, thereby lessening triglycerides. Fiber-rich foods help you feel full and prevent unnecessary snacking or overeating. Studies indicate that a low-fiber diet can boost triglycerides by up to 45% in just 6 days, whereas high fiber can dip triglycerides below the threshold level. In another study, it was found that supplementing with rice bran fiber can decrease high triglycerides by 7-8% in diabetic people. 4. Reduce your sugar intake. Sugars are a form of carbohydrates and have loads of calories. Extra sugar from your diet can cause a rise in blood triglyceride levels. All this extra sugar eventually leads to an increased risk of heart disease and stroke. Processed food like white bread, fruit juice concentrate, maple syrup, and sugary beverages contain lots of added sugar. Researches have shown that consumption of added sugar is linked to elevated levels of triglycerides in children. As it's summertime, we all like to enjoy soft drinks. But think before you drink. Try replacing them with water as this will help in reducing triglycerides by almost 29 mg per deciliter. Plus it's just better for you, all around. Another summer treat, a delicious ice cream cone, is hard to resist. If you keep it as a once-in-a-while thing, it probably won't hurt you. However, if you're eating it every other day consider frozen berries or fruit-based desserts instead. 5. Break a sweat. If you have not started exercising yet, start now. Being late is way better than never. But if you're just a beginner, there's no need to engage in intense workout routines. Studies show that basic aerobic exercises like jogging, walking, swimming, and bicycling when coupled with a weight loss regime lower triglycerides. This is because aerobic exercises increase good, HDL cholesterol, which has an inverse relationship with triglycerides. This means that high levels of HDL cholesterol can be effective in lowering triglycerides. The American Heart Association recommends getting 30 minutes of exercise at least 5 days per week. Another study suggests that jogging for 2 hours per week for 4 months can remarkably reduce triglycerides. So get yourself some fancy new gym clothes and get moving. 6. Snack on nuts. If you are looking for a healthy snack in place of chips and cookies, nuts are a perfect replacement. Tree nuts especially are a complete package of fiber, omega-3 fatty acids, and unsaturated fats, all of which are known to lower blood triglycerides naturally. And by tree nuts we mean almonds, cashews, pistachios, walnuts, and more. 
According to a study, regular nut intake can lower your triglycerides by around 2.2 mg per deciliter. 7. Cut back on alcohol. Alcohol contains high levels of calories and sugar. If these calories are not utilized, they might be converted into triglycerides, similar to food. Of course, the more you drink, the more of a threat it can be in comparison to moderate drinking. 8. Try the Mediterranean diet. The Mediterranean diet really is nothing fancy. It simply means following the traditional eating patterns of the Mediterranean region. The diet focuses on green vegetables, whole grains, legumes, olive oil, and nuts. Plus the odd glass of red wine. It's one reason why it's so popular is because it's flexible and relatively easy to follow. Studies report that following the Mediterranean diet leads to a decrease in triglyceride level by 6.5% and a reduction of 10% in total cholesterol. 9. Say no to trans, unhealthy fats. Artificial trans fat is usually found in processed foods as it increases its shelf life. It's also commonly found in fried and baked food that's usually made with hydrogenated oils. Trans fat is associated with many health problems because of its inflammatory properties, including raising bad LDL cholesterol and triglycerides. 10. Eat more fatty fish. Fatty fish has several benefits for health and can reduce triglycerides. This is because fatty fish contains omega-3 fatty acids, an essential fatty acid, meaning you need to get it from your diet. A 2016 study showed that if salmon is consumed twice a week, it can significantly reduce blood triglyceride levels. So the next time you're deciding on what to eat for dinner, try incorporating fish like tuna, sardines, salmon, or mackerel in your diet. Diet and lifestyle changes have a major impact on triglyceride levels. If you make slow and steady changes to your lifestyle, you will improve your overall health. Knowing more about diet and weight loss will certainly help in the meantime. Did you know about ways to lower triglycerides before watching this video? Let us know in the comments below.